Hi, I'm Sean Clark. Today I'm standing in front of Glenn's house from the classic film, The Gate. Welcome to Horse Holograms. So right here, this is the opening shot of the gate. We see Glenn coming down this street. In the background, you can see Travis's house way down there from the gate too. But he comes riding his bike up here, Glenn does. and heads over to his house, right here. This is Glenn's house from the gate. Nobody home. So this is the front door and the front yard. Steven Dorf's house from the gate. How cool is this? Super cool. Now this is pretty much the only location in the movie The Gate. This is Glenn's house. They pretty much shot just here and in this neighborhood. Now down the street is Terrence's house, which is featured in The Gate 2. We are now going to start featuring The Gate 2 electric boogaloo. So I'm going to show you how close these actually are. So, Glenn's house, and then down the street, Terrence's house. Now in the gate two, they did some trickery. They did not use this house in the gate two. They used another house and put fences around it and trees so you couldn't see it that well and made it look like they were right across the street from each other. They were not. So we are going to, in real time, journey over to there. 
so you can see the difference. Yeah, this is a new construction right here. Beautiful, beautiful house. My God. JTF Homes, you kicked ass. That's, that's a nice house. Building another one here. Makes you wonder, like, how much longer is Glenn's house going to be here? This one looks newer. I don't know if this was here during the gate. I'd have to check and see. But beautiful house. And right down here at the corner, we're going to see Terrence's house. So, you know, in actuality, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six houses away. Not too bad. But this house here is the one they pretend is Glenn's house in the gate two. There it is, Glenn's old house. I've been staring at it for two solid years. This is all fenced off here. And this is at 174. Yeah, 174 Curtis. And at the corner of Curtis and McC McClure, McClure. Yeah, see it does have a similar look to the one down the street. They look similar. Dad, I know I haven't talked to you much about what happened there. <laughs> you wouldn't believe most of it. But they fake that. And you go this way. And here is Terrence's house. It was the most exciting thing that ever happened to me. I think it's from right around this corner here is where the bully jumps out and sucker punches him. This was also his house in the film, The Gate, I believe. Uh, I just don't think they tried to make it look like they were as close to each other as they were. Maybe they couldn't get the rights to use the original house, so they had to fake the one over there. There's Scott on tape, by the way. He's been following me, taking notes. I know what he does. I'm on to him. And there it is, the gate two. Short episode, as I said. Who would have thought two filming locations in one episode would have been as short as it is, but uh, you know, not a whole lot from these films. It's gonna be different this time, Terry. Yeah. I'm gonna get it. Everything's gonna be great. Yeah, yeah, I know. And quite frankly, I'm not a huge fan of the Gate 2. Uh, more of a Gate 1 fan myself. But uh, since they're so close together, you kinda can't help but uh, do both. He walks by this pole, but then heads back here. So he's getting punched from this corner here. He's walking around this corner. Hi, Rat Boy, how's it going? <laughs> it's going. Cool. Yeah, okay. And when he's laying on the ground, you can see that fireplace. Lewis's back of Lewis's house. Because what I find interesting, Sean. What do you find interesting, Scott? Is 
as someone who's not very familiar, I, I've been to these locations before. But I'm not very familiar with the movie like you are with mm -hmm. these. But this house does look exactly like the one from the first one. It does. And so they had it all, you know, blocked off for gate two. But we're wondering why did they not get permission to use the original house, or is it just makes it a better? Hmm. Like the houses are so close together. It's four houses up, right? Five houses up. This is a question for Tibor Takis. Can Only we call Tibor? He, I, I don't have him on speed dial, but you know I'll look into it. Hey Siri, call Tibor. Well, I don't see a Tibor in your contacts. Okay. But you know, there's the the real house down there, and uh, which is yeah, I think they looked really identical. that one. One thing I didn't like about the gate too was that he didn't have the awesome metal clothing that he had in the first film. Maybe insinuating that he had matured, right. but I mean his venom vest and his killer dwarves vest. I mean, come on. I don't remember any of that. But anyway, this is Scott and my attempt of stretching out a video that doesn't deserve to be as well, long as it is. It's got a good four solid minutes. What do I? It has to be eight minutes to monetize it, right? No, nope. are you kidding me? I thought it was. They had a limit at one point. Did no. they change that? No, you, it's shorts and all that change oh. everything. Oh, yeah. okay. So we can actually just stop recording right now. No, no. Just get a couple shots. Yeah, he's... Okay. okay. Wait till he's behind the tree there. Get a couple of shots here. It's behind the tree. Yeah. Let's see. Let's see. This is what I want. Okay, this is where the action went down. This I know I shouldn't be doing, but come on, you come all this way. You need to get the yard from the gate, don't you? This is where the gate was, right back here. Holy shit. How crazy is this? Right back here was the gate. There's the back of the house. Now you may notice this addition right here. See that bit that just doesn't fit? Different color roof. This little curvature here, he's coming out. This was a piece that was built onto the house for the film. It's not part of the original construction. And you can make out that it looks out of place. There's the back door. Wow, this is nuts. Uh, pretty amazing. The gate was right over there. Well, I better get out of here before I get in trouble. But anyway, pretty amazing. This will be a short episode due to the fact that there's one location in this whole movie. You guys wait for me. Come on. So thank you for joining me today. The locations of Gate 1 and Gate 2. Terrence's house. We bid you adieu and we're going to head to some more locations and more episodes coming. Remember to like, subscribe, all that stuff. Come on, man. Help blow this channel up. What the hell are you doing? Do it! Just do it! <laughs>